Hi everyone, it's Brock Tozer here with this week's new music review. This time around we're going to be looking at the new project from, I think, one of Christian music's best bands, Mercy Me. Most of us first became aware of Mercy Me in the early 2000s when they burst onto the scene with their anthemic monster hit, I Can Only Imagine. Since that time, they've become a staple on Christian radio, racking up numerous hit songs, millions in record sales, and plenty of awards. Welcome to the new is Mercy Me's eighth studio album, and to my ear, this project's biggest strengths are A, energy, and B, experimentation. I've always appreciated Mercy Me's ability to remain radio friendly while keeping things fresh, maybe just a little unpredictable at the same time. Somehow they've managed to avoid falling into a musical rut, even with so many records under their belt. At least one reviewer has criticized Mercy Me for being too eclectic on this record, but I disagree. I don't hear anything on Welcome to the New that feels out of place or even that far outside of Mercy Me's comfort zone. If you haven't yet seen the music video for the lead single, Shake, which went to number one on CHRI, by the way, make sure you take a moment to watch it. It's a great example of how even Christian artists can make entertaining music videos without the big budgets that are sometimes available for mainstream pop videos. For my standout track, I'll go with the title song, Welcome to the New. I do feel like Mercy Me's lyrics could often be a lot more original and thoughtfully crafted than they are, so I'll give a slight deduction on that front. All in all, Welcome to the New is not my favorite Mercy Me album, but I'm inclined to call it their second best, just below 2010's The Generous Mr. Lovewell. So I'm giving Welcome to the New four out of five stars. If you're a Mercy Me fan, I would definitely recommend you pick it up. To hear more from Welcome to the New, join me for CHRI's Top 20 Countdown this Saturday, 3 to 5 p.m. And to stay on top of these weekly new music reviews, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Bye for now.